How's it going guys? Welcome back to Manti Gaming. So as you saw in the post, how to make 1 billion gold in three days. Well, I'm going to get right into it. So let's, uh, yeah, get right into it. So um, I have literally made 1 billion gold in the last three days and I'm extremely, extremely uh, happy about that. And I want to show, share with you guys, if you guys have any kind of uh, knowledge about my channel and everything, uh, basically, when I find good ways to make money, I post it for you guys. Uh, I'm not really the kind of person that's like, oh, I made this money. Now I'm just going to keep this and do this method on my own because I don't really care. I have so much money in this game. and I'm, I'm not trying to brag about that. I'm just being you know, quite honest about it. I have a lot of money in this game and I don't really care about trying to make the most money. I want to help people. And that's what my channel has always been about, about helping other people. So I'm going to help you guys here. So sit back, relax, grab yourself a can of Coke and let's do this. So... Uh, if you just watched uh, one of my most recent videos about making the Luck of the Dwarves ring, that has a lot to do with actually how I made uh, that $1 billion in the last three days. As you can see right here, I've got some extra cash because I, I just uh, sold a bunch of things. Um, and yeah, it's just there because there's nowhere else to put it right now. Um, but if you look at my Grand Exchange, I'll, I'll show you guys what's going on. So actually, actually, the first place I want to start is going to be my, my Wealth Evaluator. So my Wealth, my wealth Evaluator, oh, that's not the Wealth Evaluator. Where's the wealth evaluator? Uh, there it is. Okay, so uh, going by this wealth evaluator showing 8.3 billion, um, about three days ago, three, four days ago, uh, I had 7.3 billion. So um, my wealth evaluator was like 7.2 or 7.3. If you have the wealth evaluator, you know it's not exactly the most accurate because it takes it takes into account GE average prices and everything. And obviously not everything I have right now is in cash. Um, and so there is a, about 7.2, 7.3 billion on this account, uh, about three, three or four days ago. And now there is 8.3, that's 83.12 uh, million on this account. Um, I do have a lot more money than this. Uh, I just have multiple accounts and I'll get more into why I have multiple accounts in this. And it'll actually uh, kind of explain, um, how I made that much money so quickly. So, um, I typically uh, will only keep right around $5 billion on each one of my accounts. I don't like to keep any more than $5 billion on one account just because of the fact that um, I like to be able to buy a lot of things on each account. Um, and I feel like $5 billion is a, good, is a good amount of money to be able to buy whatever I want to and to be able to stock up on some things and be able to hold them for a little bit longer. If I had less money on them, I would have to end up selling stuff or transferring money a bunch of times. So right around $5, million, $5 billion is what I keep on most accounts. This is my main account though, so on main account I might keep a little bit more. But, but anyway, that'll just kind of uh, loop into right this is. So, Luck of the Dwarf Ring is was the video I just made. And actually, I did mention in the end of the, in the, end of the video, I kind of hinted towards uh, flipping them um, as them being really good money to flip. Now, the thing is, guys, uh, I, I, I was already flipping these. Um, and I that, that's basically what I've been doing. I've been buying them and I've been reselling them. I haven't really been holding them much. Uh, so if anyone's like, oh, you're trying to pump the price up, that's definitely not what I'm doing because as you can see right here, I'm, I sold these off. Um, for the most part, I am buying and selling them instantly. If you look at my grand exchange, uh, you can see I, I, I can give you an idea here um, as to how much I'm making on each one. So what I was buying them for is, let's see right here, we bought we bought Luck of the Dwarf Rings for $38 million. I bought seven of those, because mostly because I wanted to quick buy them before I made this video. Um, but as you see a little bit farther down, I got bought Luck of the Dwarves for 37.5 million, um, and that was a little bit quick of a uh, quick of a buy too. I can usually buy them for quite a bit less, um, but anyway, uh, I was buying for 37.5, and then some of them for 38. As you can see in my grand exchange, when you look in here, you can see the kind of the profit idea here, uh, because these sold at 38. Point, uh, you know, 9999. It's basically 39 million. So on the 37.5 ones, I made 1.5 million each, and then on the 38 million ones, I made 1 million each. Uh, so with a little bit of patience, you I easily could have bought them for 37 million each, um, or maybe even 36.5. And since you can buy 10 of them per for every four hours, um, which is pretty sweet. And by the way, I need to make sure my other my other account does not log out while I'm doing this. <laughs> um, since the fact that you're able to buy them for uh, 10 of them for every four hours, uh, and you are able to do a 2.5 to 3 million margin on these, that equals 25 to 30 million profit per account. Now, obviously, sometimes it's not going to be exactly 2.5 or 3 million on each one. Sometimes it's going to be a little bit less, like sometimes it'll be 2 million each, uh, 1.5 million each. So I'm going by an average of, I, I, I probably earned an average of 20 million gold per account per four hours. 
and that's only by buying 10 of these Luck of the Dwarves and selling 10 of these Luck of the, Luck of the Dwarves. And as you can see on, on, one of my, on one of my alts, I'll go right here. Um, this, is my, this is one of my other alt accounts. Uh, you can see uh, these Luck of the Dwarves I sold for 38.5 million because I bought these for 36 million each, I believe it was. I think it was 35.5 or it was 36 million each. Anyway, I made quite a bit of money on each one of those two. And as you can see, 380, 385 million is what this ended up selling for, and I probably paid 360 or 355. So as you can see right there, it's 30 million profit, guys, on the on a four-hour flip. Now keep in mind, it does not take four hours to buy and sell these. In all honesty, it takes you about uh, a grand total of 10 minutes to be able to buy 10 and sell 10. A grand total of 10 minutes. Um, if you're trying to stretch the margin a little bit more, trying to get a little bit more out of them, like maybe going for that three mil uh, margin on each one, then it might take you more like 20 or 30 minutes. But I mean, you're making 30 million possible in like anywhere from 10 to 30 minutes. So it's pretty nuts. Uh, I did this on multiple accounts. I actually did this on three different accounts. Um, uh, and so basically within the three days, uh, um, I was able to make, let's see what that would end up being. That would be 360 million gold per day if I was making 20 million per account. Um, and so I, I think, like, like I said, uh, all my buys and sells were not 2 million each on those. Some of them were 3 million, some of them were 1.5 million because, you know, the prices fluctuate and everything. Flipping is not perfect, and you'll figure that out pretty quickly if you guys are following my Flip for Wealth series. Um, but uh, anyway, yeah, it's, it was about 360 million gold um, a day is how much I was making by just doing Luck of the Dwarves. So over the last three days, um, yeah, math is not something I can currently do. So uh, that's going to be 1080 million is essentially what I would have made um, from doing three days. But obviously, since I had only made about 1 billion in the last three days, um, it, my margins were a little bit less than that. So uh, yeah, I literally made uh, about a billion gold. It, it actually, when we're looking at my wealth calculator, since it was 7.2 to 7.3, and it now says 8.3. And like I said, it's kind of hard to tell because it's not 100% accurate. Um, I, I probably made anywhere from 1 to 1.1 billion in the last three days. Uh, also, guys, something else you can be doing is I was, you know, that was purely just from the flipping. That was that was from doing 10 minutes. That was from doing 10 minutes of work every four hours. And yes, I was a super nerd and I did wake up in the middle of the night in order to do a quick flip on my three accounts because, I mean, it literally only takes like 10 minutes. And honestly, probably my, my worst margins were probably in the middle of the night when I was like, oh my God, I cannot believe I'm actually waking up to play RuneScape for, for 10 minutes. <laughs> but I mean, when you make, you know, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, whatever million it is uh, in that 10 minutes, it's definitely wor wor well worth waking up for 10 minutes in my opinion. Um, so I, yeah, I was a super nerd for the last three days and woke up and I, I was be sure I was being sure to be able to do that. Um, also, using the companion app is a really great way to do these. But I'm gonna go ahead and remove these. I'll uh, remove this cash now. As you can see, they're thirty. They're thirty-nine million. Um, actually, you know what? I'm not gonna remove all this cash because I'm gonna end up going over max cash again. Is what I'm gonna do. Um, so, uh, yeah, that is basically what I did for that. Um, you guys can definitely do that exact same thing. There's nothing really stopping you. Also, um, one billion gold is not really how much I made in the last three days. By the way, yeah, you caught me. It's not actually one billion gold. It was probably a little bit more than one billion gold. Um, and the reason why is because the fact that the components for this, so let's just, let me just give you an example right here. The components for making these rings, uh, you do have to have uh, fortunate components. You need 50 of them. So right now, if you go to World 2 GE, you can actually stand here and you will see that people are buying them. Um, I, have, I, have, I have actually sold them for up to 750000 each. And if you don't know what the components are, I can tell you real, right real quick here. So uh, let's type in magic composite bow. So Magic Composite Bow is, is an example of this. Uh, as you can see, the Grand Exchange average price is 17740 But the thing is, guys, you're not really going to get them less than like anywhere from four hundred to 500000 each. So I, I was really patient on a lot of these, and I just creeped up the prices, and I, I was getting them for 400 k each because you've got, you're have got you only able to buy two for, of these fortunate components um, uh, per four hours. So you've got like four hours to buy two items. <laughs> so I was really patient about it, in all honesty, and... Uh, I was I was definitely able to pick up lots of pieces for anywhere from three hundred fifty to four hundred thousand each, um, and the thing is about that is that when you go and you sell them in bulk, like you sell them as one big bulk, like say uh, I think the largest sale I made today was four hundred eighty seven components, and so I sold four hundred eighty seven components for I believe it was three hundred sixty two million. Yeah, it, it was it was seven hundred fifty thousand each is what I ended up selling them for, and the reason why I got so much for them is because of the fact they were in bulk. But if you guys do the quick math in that right there. Um, if, if I was buying them for three hundred fifty to 400000 each, that means that half of that money was pure profit. That means I basically made, I profited $180 million gold in one trade. And that's not, I mean, you 
you guys could go to World GE, and I mean, you can, you can find the people buying them for that. And then you can also go in the Grand Exchange, and you can try to buy them for this price right here, and you'll see they do buy. Like, you put them in for maybe like four, four and you know, put them in for like this, or put them put them in for five hundred thousand, um, whatever, whatever price you you know, as long as you're paying three hundred fifty to five hundred thousand each, you're gonna get them. Um, so if anybody's like, oh, this doesn't work, well, <laughs> there you go, guys. So um, that is legitimately how I made uh, over one billion gold in the last three days. Uh, I really hope this helps you guys out. I really, really, really do expect Luck the Dwarf Rings to be a good flip for the next, uh, I mean, I, I don't really know when they'll stop being a good flip because they are a low volume item. If you guys have not watched my Flip for Wealth series, I really encourage you guys to go check that out because I, I purposely am making that to really help teach everyone how to flip efficiently uh, and answer all the questions that people have and to literally show you as I do it and uh, and how you can follow along. Um, so if uh, if you're interested in doing this luck of the dwarf thing where you know like you're literally making this much money and this, these are not exaggerated numbers guys I mean they're, they're literally right here in front of you. Um, I highly recommend you go watch that flip for wealth series first uh, and I'm not really I'm not trying to just promote my other videos so you go watch them so I get ad clicks. But trust me I make hardly anything from ads on, on YouTube, like pretty much nothing. Um, so uh, I'm legitimately just trying to help you guys out. Uh, so please go check that out if you're interested in doing this because that way you don't screw it up. If you have no idea how to flip and you guys try to start with Luck of the Dwarves, you could end up losing money and I don't want that to happen to you. Um, so uh, yeah, I you know, and you got plenty of time, plenty of time. Like I've been doing this, I've been doing this Luck of the Dwarves since they came out uh, and you know, I've, I've almost made a max cash stack on just Luck of the Dwarves flip since they've re since they've been released. I mean, that's pretty mind-blowing. So definitely worth your time, definitely worth learning if you don't know how to flip. Uh, you know, like, I constantly hear people saying, like, oh, I don't know how to flip. I'm terrible at it. You only get better if you try and if you practice. So all right, guys. Oh, by the way, if you guys are looking for some extra help, you want you guys want more money-making methods and stuff like that, you can always check out my Patreon page in the description below. The Patreon page is a great way to help support the channel and help to promote more and more videos being released like this one. April is going to be a ridiculous amount of uploads, um, and I'm really excited about it bringing April to you guys. Uh, so if you guys would uh, would like to support the channel, and also in exchange, you do get a whole lot of money-making methods or other stuff that you guys are interested in, like flip, flipping lists and everything. I mean, you guys can just go check out the Patreon page if you want to. All, all of the different uh, benefits you get, depending on what you are donating, is, is written on the right. So if you guys have any questions about that, feel free to let me know. There are quite a few people on there. It's been around for over a year now, so if anyone's wondering, hey, does it work? Well, hey, there you go. There's That just kind of shows you with how many people have uh, consistently been using the Patreon for a very long time. And uh, yeah, I just I really have a lot of fun making content. I really have a lot of fun helping you guys out, so I really do appreciate you guys are watching my videos. Please subscribe and like if you enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys in the next one.